Hello and welcome everybody and thank you guys for joining me once again. My name is Wilkie and I'm back with the first proper Critica Online a video, I guess, from Open Beta. I did have an internet outage this morning, which kind of sucks, because I was planning to grind through with the two people I started leveling with, because they are level 60 now and I'm basically stuck at 52, which kind of is shit. I did not manage to spend all of my rest points. I was roundabout left at, I think... I think I had around 80 or so points left. Uh, which kinda is not that great. But, well, it happened. I didn't know, first of all, the reset for the European server is now somewhere in the morning times, so in the morning hours. I do not exactly know when it is. So I'll have to figure that out. Because I planned or I assumed it's gonna be the same as it used to be in uh, closed beta. But I was wrong. And that's not actually when the reset is for our server. So I banked onto that, unfortunately, that was not the case. So I basically missed one um, set of dailies for gems, one set of dailies for the PvP arena. And uh, I did actually do the money daily, but that's probably one of the least important things that I did. Oh well. But that's generally just how uh, things are. So now I'm going to actually grind a bit more, try to catch up to the other people. Uh, there might actually be level 65 people by now. Or maybe people actually getting close to that. So I'm not entirely sure what the intention really was, because... Honestly, they handed out... What? Shoot, I forgot items. They handed out... Um, certain items. 300 rest points for your first purchase of cred. Um... And XP potions and things like that. So there, there was a lot. There was a lot of uh, stuff that allowed us to pretty much continuously play on purple rest points, which allowed us to level that fast. Because there would nowhere near would be people that fast yet. So there's that. So I don't entirely know why they nerfed the XP in hard mode, and they just did that. I mean. It's literally the, it's the smallest purchase. I think it's enough if you buy 100 cred, you will get the package. So I think the majority of people did actually go for that. I mean, everybody who has a Founders Pack does have EMP. So all you get to do is exchange for 100 cred. You don't even have to use the cred. All you have to do is just buy it. And um, then you can spend the cred whenever you want to and get the care package. So as I said, I'm, I'm a bit confused as to why they would do that because they wanted to slow us down but in the end there's gonna be a super bunch of people max level before the game actually fully releases so uh, yeah I, I, don't, I don't know about that but it is what it is so I mean in the end it's not it's not that much of a difference but it still gives the head start people an edge Obviously, over the people who did not have a head start. I mean, that's the point of a head start, really. So, what is dude? Oh, yeah, holy shit. Yeah, running insane alone is just very tedious. This mobs have so much HP. Blech. Get wrecked. And yeah, other than that, there have been a bunch of rebalances. There have been new patch notes already saying. Um, that they actually kind of rebalanced PvP a bit too much, as it seems. So, uh, there's that. I haven't PvP'd yet because I tried to focus on to PvE for now, but, uh, yeah. I mean, from what I heard, it's just really too much. So, they, they just went overboard on, um, pretty much everything. Oops. That low levels can pretty much not PvP at all, as it seems. Because the damage you're dealing is just absurdly low. Dude. Right, oh shit, I might actually die now. Alright, we got this guy. As you can see, insane. It's still pretty much doable. My gear is not that great. But... In terms of XP and efficiency, I'm not entirely sure if it's really the smartest thing to um, run insane. You might actually be faster in terms of time ratio 
running on hard mode, albeit you'll lose a bit of XP because you're not getting the full multiplier, but if you're a solo player, it's probably better if you're just running on hard. And um, if you're having a party, obviously you should run insane. There's no reason to go hard in a party. But yeah, that's just generally all about my progress so far. This video does not really contain any content, does it? Not really. And um, that's pretty much all about that. I'll check out PvP later this evening. And I'm not, I don't think I'll actually be max level before the actual launch of the game. But then again, I don't really care. I'm not in a hurry. Uh, we just basically blasted through because I joined the party with those guys and I was like, all right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to burn my rest points on the first day and then I'm good. But since we basically got an additional 300 rest points through the package, I was like, well, just use it. You have a party, it's going good. Why the hell not use it? So there's that. And that's pretty much the reason why I'm here right now. Other than that, people are pestering me already. I forget to mute. So there's that. Anyways, uh, there are a bunch of events actually running. You either can check the forums. I do hate that when that happens. I'm not entirely sure why they did that. If you level up, you're gonna use lose all of your first stacks for Doomblade, which is kind of very silly. But eh. whatevs. Other than that, there's not that much uh, that has changed so far. Grinding still seems just fine. Uh, drop rates are different. That's probably the best way to put it. Because some things drop a, a whole lot more and other things don't seem to drop at all. Like I only found one legendary so far. I had absolutely zero intrusions. Somebody said intrusions were disabled. I'm not sure if that's true or not. But there's that. And um, as far as the rest goes, everything seems to be working relatively smoothly. Guilds and stuff, everything has been made. So there's a lot of progress actually flowing into the game. So we might be able to see some proper or at least more entertaining PvP in the future. We still don't know if gear is taken out of the equation now. We just know that there's a rebalance, but we don't know what exactly that rebalance consists of. So uh, there's that. But we'll figure that out in, I don't know, a couple days. I guess on the weekend we should have more information regarding how things actually are now, what did actually change and what did not change. So we'll see about that. Anyways, that's all for my, I guess, first OBT or Head Start video. So there's that. Oh shoot, damn, that fucking guy almost wrecked me pretty hard. This should probably go for that skill. Shit, what? That was not cool at all. <laughs> Don't let him get up. Then we're all good. Oh shoot! No! He was so close to death. Really? <laughs> Did I have to die? Like, wait, that's one skill! Oh god. Oh man. There go my resurrection snake. But yeah, that's all really for the first video. I will make an update video because there is, I'm not sure what it exactly is, but my Facebook is bugging out completely. I cannot really answer any comments, any questions. Um, I don't even see my posts anymore. I did already message the support, but I did not receive any answer yet. But I'll make a quick follow-up video on the weekend about that if it doesn't work. Because there have been a bunch of people messaging me on Facebook and unfortunately I cannot reply. And I tried several browsers, I tried relogging, I tried using my phone, nothing works. So, we'll see about that in the future how it goes. Anyways, that's all for today. Um, there is another game I might actually play in the midst, even though there's a head start and something, because there's a, a closed beta of a game coming out. So I might do a video on that. Other than that, thank you guys for joining. And as always, I hope I will catch you later.